we're going to discuss the markup formula where we have S as the selling price, C as the cost of the product before the markup, and R is the markup rate, which is usually given as a percentage, and that we rewrite into a decimal. Markup formula is where a company or store buys products from the vendors, but they can't sell it for that price because they need to make a profit. They add a markup cost in which we get the selling price. We will be using this formula in this next example. The manager of a store buys a product for $42. So he, this is the cost he pays to the vendor. If the markup rate is 9%, what is the selling price? And be sure to round your answer to the nearest cent. So this is the rate in which he will mark up this product he bought for $42. If we add the markup cost, we will get how much he would sell the product in his store. Okay, so the first thing we should do is label our parameters. So it says, what is the selling price? Well, S is the selling price, so S we don't know. C is the cost of the product before the markup. So he bought the product for $42. So that would be C. R is usually the easiest to spot because it's always the percentage and its rate is 9%. But if we wanted to actually use this in multiplying, adding, dividing, and subtracting, we would have to change it to 0.09. So don't forget to move the decimal over twice and rewrite it as a decimal. All right, so now we're ready to plug this into our formula. The markup formula is S equals C plus RC. The selling price we don't know, but the cost of the product is $42 plus the rate, which we will write as 0.09 and the cost of the product again. So this looks like a simple calculation and don't forget we're gonna be rounding to the nearest cent. So now we can go to our calculator and put in exactly this. 42 plus 0 0.09 times 42. And notice that we round to the nearest cent, which is the eight, and it's 45.78. So the selling price is $45.78. Notice when we mark up a product, the selling price will be more than the cost because the manager has to mark up the product. It makes sense why the selling price would be a few dollars more.